Tonight, we are learning there have been several arrests in connection with the shooting of a popular rapper in, Jer in New Jersey. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, Film Spire. Let's head into how Lil Tay got shot and is still recovering. June the 22nd. Lil TJ, a Bronx rapper, was injured in a gunshot in New Jersey on Wednesday and is allegedly in surgery. TJ's condition and the extent of his injuries are unknown. According to reports, around 12.08 a.m., police responded to a call of shots fired at a Chipotle restaurant at City Palace in Edgewater, New Jersey, and discovered a 22-year-old man shot multiple times, before discovering another 22-year-old man with a single gunshot wound at a nearby Exxon gas station. The second victim's name is unknown, and it is uncertain if TJ was the victim discovered at the Chipotle restaurant or the one discovered at the station. Ruby Rose hints at Lil Tay being the one victim that was shot multiple times. Both victims were taken to a nearby hospital for medical treatment for their injuries. Responding officers discovered a 22-year-old victim with several gunshot wounds, the Bergen County Prosecutor's Officer Mark Musela stated in a statement. Officers were also sent to the Exxon station at 478 River Road in Edgewater, where they discovered another 22-year-old victim with a gunshot wound. Both victims were taken to a nearby hospital and are being treated. Lil TJ, who first gained attention with his 2018 single Resume, has emerged as one of New York City's biggest rap talents in recent years, releasing two studio albums, True To Myself in 2019 and Destined To Win in 2021. Authorities have detained a suspect in the shooting of rapper Lil TJ. TJ was apparently the subject of an attempted robbery, which resulted in many gunshot wounds to the 21-year-old. Another associate was injured as well. The Bergen County, New Jersey Prosecutor's Office announced the arrest of 27-year-old Mohamed Kanate in connection with the shooting on Wednesday evening, June the 22nd, with the assistance of New York City Police Department. In connection with the shooting on Wednesday morning at the Promenade, an upscale residential and shopping neighborhood in Edgewater, New Jersey, Kanate has been charged with three counts of attempted murder, three counts of armed robbery, and several other unlawful weapons crimes. In addition to Kanate, two other young men were arrested, Jeffrey Valdez and Antoine Boyd, the latter of whom was originally reported to have been shot during the incident. Both males have been charged with second-degree unauthorized possession of a weapon and have been committed to Bergen County Jail. They will appear before a judge at the Central Judicial Processing Court in Hackensack, New Jersey, at an undetermined time. An initial statement of the incident was published on Wednesday morning, with the news of Lil TJ being one of the victims confirmed shortly thereafter by media agencies. The Bergen County Prosecutor's Office Major Crimes Unit and the Edgewater Police Department are investigating a shooting that occurred at 14 The Promenade, Edgewater, New Jersey, on Wednesday the 22nd of June 2022. The statement reads, At approximately 12.08 a.m. on June the 22nd, the Edgewater Police Department responded to a 911 call reporting a shooting at that address. Responding officers found a 22-year-old victim with multiple gunshot wounds. Officers also responded to the Exxon station located at 278 River Road, Edgewater, where they located another 22-year-old victim with a gunshot wound. Both victims were transported to an area hospital where they are being treated. Lil TJ underwent emergency surgery on Wednesday and was initially listed as being in a critical condition, but has since been upgraded to stable. Jim Jones still believes rappers have the most dangerous job, an initial statement regarding the shooting was issued on Wednesday morning, with news of Lil TJ being one of the victims in question, confirmed by media outlets shortly after. July the 11th. New information tonight in the shooting of rapper Lil TJ. Three arrests have been made, and prosecutors say one of the men tried to... Lil TJ will personally debunk the death news that surrounded him when he was still fighting for his life after the shooting incident. The hip-hop industry was left in deep shock after Lil TJ, whose real name is Tyone Jaden Merritt, was shot multiple times.